What's up friends, fellow card collectors, Card Hobbies here, and today we're going to go over my binder haul for the month of June. Uh, got quite a bit of stuff, not as much as I did in May. Um, May was a crap ton of stuff, uh, but June did okay, uh, especially with the Hall of Famers. First, we're just going to go through and look at some football, because I only picked up a few football cards for my PC uh, this past month. Um, let's take a look at these. So we got a cut above Dan Marino, a uh, auto of Tony Lippett, I believe Airtime sent me this, which is awesome, Josh Rosen Illusions, uh, Fleer All Pros, Michael Irvin, another Michael Irvin, these are from my Canes collection, Edron James, uh, Reggie Wayne, uh, another Reggie Wayne, um, Unleashed, and a Frank Gore end zone uh, from Score, so those are all the football I picked up. Uh, I got plenty of... Uh, I wouldn't say plenty, but I got quite a few Braves cards. I'm not going to name all these. But these are all Braves cards I did not have. So all these are going to end up in my Braves binder. Some cool stuff in there. A lot of stuff I got out of these um, insert lots I bought on eBay. Um, Michael Bourne Purple. Uh, Kimbrel Ice. Pretty nice. Uh, Mini Upton. Shout out to Airtime. Who loves minis? Um, Jason Hayward. Uh, there's Freddie Freeman Fred McGriff. Uh, you may have heard Freddie Freeman did test positive. Uh, for the virus, so he's gonna have to sit out at least a couple weeks. Let's see, is there anything else? There's a Freddie Freeman shock parallel, instant impact Acuna from Prism, uh, 150 years of fun, uh, opening day Mike Soroka cup card, and this uh, the lighter side of baseball. These are actually pretty rare. They're these are kind of hard to pull uh, from opening day. Um, if you go back and watch my video. I'd, don't remember exactly what I estimated the print run of that at, but that was the most rare insert from opening day. And it's awesome that I pulled one. Not only that I pulled one, that I pulled a one for the PC. So as usual, the bulk of my binder haul is going to be Hall of Famers. So we're just going to scroll through these real quick. Try not to take too much time. So we got some Robbie Alomar Provisions cards in jacked up shape. Uh, I love this card because it reminds me, I used to play Magic back in the day. Um, this reminds me of the Sarah Angel card <laughs> from back then. Uh, Roberto Alomar, Future Heroes, here's a uh, Alomar Silver Signature. Um, Tops 3D, uh, Ringmasters, here's a Bagwell Pinnacle. Uh, Baines, Ernie Banks, Cool Papa Bell. Um, Craig Biggio till it's over, some Boggs, there's a Brett, Ray Campanella, Archetype Steve Carlton, there's an Andre Dawson, um, Andre Dawson Golden Moments, the Eck, a few Eck cards in here, uh, another Golden Moments, Carlton Fisk, Whitey Ford, uh, from that, uh, Cons Hillshire Farm Collection, uh, high grade Lou Gehrig. This thing's got a ding corner on it. It's okay. Nestle Golden Era Lou Gehrig. Uh, Bob Gibson from Hillshire Farms. Ted Williams Collection. Bob Gibson. Uh, Record Breakers. Hank Greenberg. Griffey. Griffey. Tony Gwynn. Here's a Roy Halladay Tops Town card. Die Cut Ricky Henderson. Uh, Billy Herman. Catfish Hunter. Fergie Jenkins. Golden Moments, Derek Jeter, Chasing History, Derek Jeter. Ooh, triple play, Derek Jeter. Yeah, I will even take a triple play, Hall of Famer. Uh, Derek Jeter, 2015. Another 2015, Derek Jeter. Shows him walking off the field. Got some uh, big unit, Randy Johnson. Own the game, Randy Johnson, very shiny. Tops total, stitches in time, Randy Johnson. Him batting, which I always think is funny when they show pitchers batting. Unless you're like Shohei or, you know, Lorenzen or Mad Bum. I don't know why they show pitchers batting. Uh, <laughs> Felix Hernandez uh, and Randy Johnson. Randy Johnson, there's a K line. Uh, I got this out of the uh, one of those mystery lots um, from eBay, which was actually pretty good. Um, Harmon Killebrew. Uh, another Harmon Killebrew from Hillshire Farms. Chuck Klein, Barry Larkin, a couple Barry Larkins, got a Bob Lemon from Archives, Greg Maddox Archetypes, Headliners, so some Maddox in here, Championship Braves, Maddox Vintage, 
uh, Maddox Holographics, I think these are called. Um, Picture Perfect Edgar. Pedro, Chasing History Hollow, Gold, Willie Mays, Willie Mays, Golden Moments, Molitor 87, a few Molitors, uh, Joe Morgan, Gallery of Stars, Jack Morris, Dishwashers, I just crack every time I see Dishwashers, 71 Phil Negro, sent to me by uh, every time as well, uh, Cooperstown Green, Cracked Ice, um, Satchel Page, that was a pretty cool card, uh, Mike Piazza, Another Piazza, some Puckets, quite a few Puckets, it's a Prism Pucket, red, white, and blue, Pee Wee Reese, this was donated to me in the last uh, Bargain Buster group break, not the last one, but the previous last one, uh, we got Jim Rice, some Ripken, uh, this card's kind of scuffed up on the front, but doesn't matter to me, we got a Ripken Stadium Club, Don Russ got some Rivera's. Uh, we got the regular and the hollow gold. Uh, Brooks Robinson, another Brooks Robinson. Uh, Pudge. This was cool. That also came in one of those uh, eBay mystery boxes. A white border chrome refractor from 2007. Pudge and Strasburg. Pudge, 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 Pudge. Babe Ruth. Nolan Ryan. Some 90s Nolan Ryan I didn't have. Don Russ. Turn back the clock. Sandberg, uh, got this beat up card. Nettles and Mike Schmidt from uh, 77. Uh, Mike Schmidt gold hollow foil. Some Ozzy Smith, Ozzy Smith mini. Black gold, John Smoltz. Lee Stargell. Tomei. Tomei own the game, shiny card. Tomei Sluggers, there's a Trammel. Uh, Ultra All Star Larry Walker. So some Larry Walkers in there as well. Put on your sunglasses. Yes, and closing it out with Yunt. So there you go, folks. That is my binder haul for June. Let me know what you think. I got to get all these organized into binder pages and put into my binders, uh, which is a duty all unto itself. <laughs> Collecting's only half the battle, right? Uh, sorting and storing, that's the other half of the battle. Um, but all you collectors out there know the, know the struggle. It's a constant thing, you know, sorting and collecting is never finished, so sorting is never finished, so storage is never finished. <laughs> and then by the time you think you got the storage finished, what have you gone and done but acquired more stuff? So um, I already got another stack for uh, for my July uh, binder haul. I got to start working on that too. <laughs> Hopefully I get that sorted in time for the end of the month and I can show you that video in August. So uh, appreciate everybody watching. Um, remember I will be live on Tuesdays and Thursday nights uh, for the most part usually. Um, cardboard happy hour. I sell cheapo cards, 10 cent cards, quarter cards, 50 cent cards, dollar cards. Uh, all my big cards people wonder oh why don't you do an auction. I've been asked before. Why don't you do an auction like where's your you know your your higher value cards. And in case you're wondering what happens to all my higher value cards. They end up in those, the three dollar repacks I do. Uh, we sometimes you get those in the Bargain Buster group break. Sometimes people purchase them. Uh, if you do get in the B Bargain Buster group break, I give away a, three of those every uh, group break. So yeah, definitely um, check out the website cardobvious.com. Thank you all for watching. Remember, you can only control two things: that's your thoughts and your actions. So stay positive. Keep collecting them cards. Keep filling up them binders, top loaders, slabs, however you collect. Just keep on. And uh, be awesome, be awesome to others, and I'll catch you all later. Peace.